is Lexi from the Pelican Girls, and it is uh, probably about 9.30. Just got to the shop not too long ago. We open at 10, so today is just gonna be like a day in the store vlog, and we're going to show you some of the things that we do um, when customers aren't here, and just how we are juggling all of the different things that we're doing when it comes to like our vintage goods. Um, Today is actually the first day that we're going to work on um, our website and all of that while we're at the shop and attempt to get everything here listed on our website. So let's get started. I'm sorry, babe. It's fine. I didn't fine. you were here already. I told you we'd be here for nine. Oh, did you? I did. Oh, shit. I don't even remember. I'm so sorry. It's not a big deal. Oh my god, they came out so good. I think they came out pretty good. Yeah. No. You know how I like white. I pressed and everything, it still has a little bit of weight. Very you see how it's kind of pinkish like reddish yes. that's, that's that wood tone but it looks old i don't see you know, that it's very pinkish well i see it because you've been staring at it yes but i i waxed to both of them and so i but i wanted it to look like it came out of an old house no i love it and they look so good you know what i mean like it came yeah. out of an old house like, like that bookcase does not even look like the same bookcase. Like all those people that said they wanted it. I know. I don't know if they're gonna want it now. It doesn't even look like the same thing. Hey, whatever. Someone's gonna want it because it is amazing. <laughs> but oh I love it. This right here I wanted it to look and it and it does. It looks almost like planks. Yeah. It does. I my arm, my shoulders hurt today. I am like hurting. I'm like tired. I work so hard on this shit. Um I sanded that thing till I mean I sanded the shit out of it to make it look like that because I wanted it to look like it came out of like an old farmhouse or something like that. And I'm this is not even they, neither one of them look the same. No, they don't. No, I'm so gonna have to, I'm gonna like it, yeah. Like, well, I'm gonna insert pictures of like what they were before, before and because after, yeah, they are yeah. amazing. Yeah, and but like I said, white is so hard to work with because it's so it's just. It's it's just hard to work with. It, a dark color is not hard to work with. Yeah. But a white because yeah, it covers. So just. So we're just you're taking pictures and then we're bringing them to the shop or they well, stay in here um, and something else is gonna go. I'm mean, gonna keep this here and maybe I don't know. I don't know. I haven't made a decision yet. What we're if, what we're bringing? What needs to be something needs to be brought there and some, some, something needs right. to be brought here. Officially open, and we're just um, replying back to some people. I guess you're really short. I think I'm just gonna take a picture of these and post them on our thing, and if anyone will look at them, yeah, yeah. So we're just replying back to some questions we had about some things that we had posted before um, that we didn't remember the prices of. So, and then we've been doing a lot of Facebook. And even Instagram sales, people see what they we post. They say, "Oh, I want that," and they can pick it up. So we're gonna post this furniture on Facebook first before we even attempt to like put stuff on it because we're just gonna take it off, right? Yeah. And it was a really big purchase. Yes. Um, she purchased two religious items. She got like a little stool. And she got this amazing old vintage phone that I 
that we have been it. loving and everybody's been admiring and it finally it's sold. sold. And it's sold. sold. It's cool. Yes, uh, very cool. So now we're gonna have to replace. I'm working on the website and she is going to go replace all the holes. So I'm gonna go fill the hole right now. So what we try to do is we try to process some of the stuff that comes in, clean it up, price it, and we have a shelf. And that way whenever stuff does sell, we go in, we pull, and it's already priced and it's already clean. Yeah. That way I don't have to worry about that. Like right now there's nobody in here, but if let's say like customers are coming in, you already have stuff to put out. Right. So that's what we're trying to get to. Yeah. I'm gonna go in here and see for something to replace. Oh, it's dark in here. Okay, I want something to replace the telephone. Ooh, we got slim pickings in here. We need to process some more stuff. I might, oh, I know what I'm gonna do. Okay, these are vintage E. Brody, I think is what it's called, vases. And they were very, very popular. Um, with, I, I'm thinking it's like a floral, like a maybe you got flowers in these vases like that. There's all different kinds of shapes and sizes and they all have like this squiggly stuff on the front and I am just in love with them. I like fresh flowers. You can never have enough vases. So that is one of the ones that we do pick up quite often. And I have, I have like, I think we have like three or four different um, shapes, different sizes and shapes. So I'm gonna put that one out there. And then I gotta find something. I think I'm gonna move these birds right here, Lex, cause it's kind of, you can't really see them right there. Let's move them here. I think I'm gonna move them here. I almost, I almost sold those the other day, but the, but the older, but she took the other ones. She took the other ones? Yeah. She needed all of them. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. So I'm just gonna put them right, put it right there. Yeah. Put those right there, and then we'll just kind of work in something else. We'll work in something else right here. So let's go see what we can. Maybe we'll put these in the toppers right here, so that's not so crowded down there. That way we can kind of spread this out a little bit where it doesn't look like it's so crowded. And I just place those right there. Alrighty. Awesome. Okay. So that kind of covers, that kind of covers that. All right. Where are you gonna put this? You're gonna put it here. Hey guys, so it's the next day, it's Wednesday, and um, we're closed on Wednesdays. Normally this is our day to like source and shop, but it is very nasty outside. It's a real, real, real dreary, <laughs> a real dreary day. So yes. um, we decided to come to the shop and do some work. Uh, Mom is working on changing up some vignettes. And I am posting some stuff to our website, thepelicancurls.com. You can shop with us anytime there. Um, so, that's what we're doing today, huh? And then we're going to the booth. She doesn't want to, but I, I think I'm gonna make her. Yeah, we might have to go to the booth. Cause we, we really have stuff need that needs to go. To go we brought and we sold something, at least one thing, that was big. No, we sold the coffee table too. We haven't been to the Uh-uh. We sold the coffee. No, 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 yeah, I did. You did go. I was like, wait a minute. You Never brought mind. a coffee Never table. Mind. I brought another coffee table. Yes, I did. Yeah. I was, I have been. But we sold a table and I don't know what else. Yeah, so we really need to go kind there of. There might be more stuff sold. We are, we're we bringing this to the booth. Um, This that we showed y'all yesterday, this bookshelf. Uh, we posted it on Facebook yesterday and someone purchased it. So it's on hold. They're going to come get it tomorrow. So. That's not even gonna be there. We probably if it hasn't gone to the booth already, it might need to go to the booth. Or it might need to be changed with something else that needs to go to the booth. The stuff yeah. Stuff on the on there? So you're on saying? There. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Then we have to take everything off of that and that's going to the booth. So yeah. that going to the this booth. Is to this the booth. is going to the booth and yeah. then some smalls, which we have a box. 
right back that there for sure is all going to the booth pillows sure so and whatever else we pull I just don't want if it's been to the booth I want it to kind of sit here a while well yeah of course and then and if it sat here a while we need to bring it to the booth yeah and then sit, to kind of just switch out trying to get the website up so people can shop whenever we're not open that I think that's an important thing or just shop from home in general yes even when we're open they can shop and then yes. come pick it up that same day yes definitely um yes because we will be shipping and we'll be offering local pickup yeah. in the boutique so and we're not putting everything on there we're only putting things that are not difficult to ship so we're not we're not going crazy because we i don't i'm not right now stuff. not yet yeah maybe one day we're, we're making so. it yeah we're making it easy on ourselves just to get started all right well let's let's get to work we'll check in later customer come knock on our door and be like oh y'all are closed we're like no no come inside come, in, come, in, come, in. come inside and um it was actually a woman that had come in last week when i was working by myself um and she was looking specifically for these nut crushers um i'll put a, a picture a right nut here chopper. nut chopper yeah a vintage nut chopper vintage. and um and we didn't have any and so i told her i said well there's someone at our vendor mall that has some and I directed her to where it was and everything and I was like okay that's it you know and then the next day or two days later we went to we go went to a stasol and we found some that's two. two of them and I was like oh my gosh like I, we found them so I, I posted it on Facebook about it and um you know in hopes that she I even put like a customer asked about these right we didn't hear anything well then I was like okay what was her name and, and this is the good thing about a small town because um, she told me who her daughter was and all of my family knows who her daughter was so I just happened to ask my grandma uh, her what her name her was yeah and so she knew her name and so I was able to tag her and then she stopped by and bought one just like that y'all if you're not on social media you're missing, out you're missing out because how else would I have been able to get in touch with this customer? I mean, I guess I could have taken her name and number, but yeah, but social media is free too, y'all. And it's free it's and it was free. easily accessible. Yes. And use it. Also, I think it looks good because now people who saw that post, they're like, oh, hey, if I go and I ask about something and they, they maybe they'll look for it, you know, it kind of puts so, it in other people's minds like, oh, they're going to go look for it. You never know what we might find. That's the thing. Yeah. That's why if they don't ask, then how, you know, mm -hmm. it's always good and to I mean, ask. we might have never found one of those nut choppers ever. Yeah. But the fact that we found it two days later is hilarious. Clothes, we still sold something, so that's awesome. Um, and mom finished with all the vignettes. I ended up listing 10 items on our website. And so if you haven't visited our website, we are working yep. on it. We got new things on there. Yes. And Everything on there, like, we will ship. So we've changed the, she's changed the theme. She's, re, she's revamping the whole website. Yep. So it looks really good. We're getting there. We're getting there. So come to the booth and fluff it up a little bit. It's nothing crazy because they are open right now. And it's always hard to go when they're open. But we didn't really have an option today. tables, added some height, added some pillows, and we're done for the day. Yeah, I think, yeah, we got a lot accomplished today, though. Yep. Yeah. Yep. It's full again, so that's good. All right, thanks for watching. Thank you. We will catch up with you all next time. Bye. Comment, comments. subscribe. We love comments. Give us a thumbs up. Thumbs up. Bye. Bye.